Hey guys, what's up? It's Sarah back at again with another video. So by the title of video, if you couldn't tell what's already happening, I'm practical and practically going through a hair transformation today. All right, so I had the option between these two colors and I searched for many videos on this, but there's no video that ever told me like how long this lasts and when it fades away, does it fade away to this or does it fade away to brown? So since I'm really skeptic about this and my mom is only letting me touch my hair once and then after that I'm done, I'm not going to go for that because uh, this is a little bit too sketchy. So I'm going to go with blonde. So I had to sign this particular thing as proof to my mom that after this I will no longer do anything to my hair. So it's go time. Okay, so now the cutting process first because my hair has a lot of split ends. Okay, so the cutting process is finished and now time for the bleach process. And God, for her, better you join us. It's the phone I'm going to It's better time I move home. Huh? You turn your pause for Zanny. Yeah, sure. So I just did the whole like. Um, thing with Turkish coffee where you flip it over onto like a plate and then let it sit and like then it show pictures of like what your future could be kind of like Harry Potter divination class um, style and like most Persians do that and it's kind of like I guess like future telling and um, before you do that typically you're supposed to wish of something to happen and I'm not going to exactly say what I wished because in theory if I say what I wished then it might not come true but I'll give you a hint what it's about just good luck Charlie <laughs> I'll stop with my Disney references is this is this a new style should this be a new style all oh, my hair like this and just like gelled I feel like this was already a style at one point oh no you know what that's a new style there we go yep beautiful Oh, by the way, if you guys are wondering, like, I didn't say in the video, beginning of the video who was doing my hair. If you guys were wondering, uh, my wonderful grandmother that I'm not going to show on camera because she doesn't want me to, uh, she is doing my hair. And don't think like, oh, wow, why? Like, that's not professional. She actually used to be, this used to be her, 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 her profession. So she knows what she's doing. I just realized something. My hair is already super damaged to the point where my natural curls can't show up that well. Now I'm just ruining the chances even more of my natural hair coming back again. Because the original reason why my curly hair just looks ugly naturally is because I bleached it so it just it doesn't look the greatest and now I'm kind of just putting more chemicals into my hair. Oh well. I never liked my naturally curly hair anyways, it was too expensive to maintain. So for some reason, our solution that was at first like super white is now a pastel pink. 
And my theory is because, like, every time she dips the brush into my hair and then back into the bleach, I feel like the color of my, this hair transfers into there and kind of, like, mixes up. But that's just my theory. But she's, my grandma says that, no, that's just, like, maybe after, like, it's oxidized or something or it's naturally that color after a while. So I'm not a professional. I don't know anything. I'm just, I'm just a teenager that hates my hair. So... All of my roots have been done and now um, after she finishes the roots completely we're gonna get to these uh, bleach parts but not really bleach because in real life it kind of looks like a faded out orange and we don't want that we want full blonde and this is how much of the uh, dye we have left I hope that this amount is enough for the rest of my hair if not I'm doomed so now we're getting to the tips of my hair and hopefully we can salvage all of the what a little is left of that um, dye to get to all of my roots. What I'm hoping is that since my roots are already bleached but with a little bit of color, we won't need that much of the dye to lighten it. So if things all go well, we won't need to get a second box, hopefully. Okay, so everything is in here is almost scraped clean and um, well, let's see what it looks like. So after she's done with that, I gotta let it sit for about 45 minutes uh, or to an hour. I don't know, I have to look at the box, but most likely with my dark brown hair, 45 to 15 minutes and 45 to 50 minutes, and then I'll wash it out. And you guys will go through the, pro like see the process with me. New uh, 2018 hair, hair trend, no? Am I the only one that sees it? Maybe. But like, you know, properly done, not all greasy looking like this, but. And now we wait. All right, I fully showered um, off my hair and blow dried it, but I didn't film the process because then that would be a spoiler on how it looks like. So I'm gonna show you now. But before I do, let me just um, let you know on something. If you have very dark hair like me, like very dark brown hair, I suggest using two boxes of this to spread all over here, make sure it's as saturated in the solution as possible. And also, I only left my hair in, like the product in, with one box just for an hour. But I suggest keeping it in for two more, at least two hours, but maybe more. Because since this doesn't have such a high percentage of bleach in it, it'll take longer to process in your hair, especially for people of darker hair color. Now, Brad Mondo, if you're watching, you're about to like, you're about to start quaking because it turned so ugly. Y'all ready for the reveal? Y you guys, are you guys ready to be disgusted? literally it only ble it only bleached my roots and gave it this nice strawberry blonde color but since i didn't leave it in for too long because my mom didn't let me um it literally look look at the blending look at this is terrifying any hairstylist would see this would literally throw up while looking at this and you know what i typically don't like to curse on my channel because i like to keep it family friendly but i'm going to be really honest this fucking sucks it's disgusting I hate it but you know what there's no tea against the actual brand like the L'Oreal box brand because I just didn't do it right for my own hair type so like I said if you have um you can't really see how dark it is here because like the the box kind of like lightened it a bit but if you have very dark brown hair then I suggest like really saturating it, so suggest I use two boxes and leaving it in for at least two hours or more. If my mother allows me, I'm probably going to do that. I'm going, but like I'm gonna add another box into like this and keep it in for two hours because it didn't even do anything to this. It still looks like this. So hopefully I will be able to fix it. And if I do, there will be another clip after this showing how different it looks. Uh, so for everyone watching, uh -huh. this is what ah, it looks ah. like. <gasps> wow! No, no, this is not good. Man, go after mesh, but she mesh ain't it, dike? No, that's not right. Really, you're for shanks, you're for shanks, you're for shanks. No, anyway, this is 
بدون And then my hippie, no, dark brown, and then here is blonde, and then light brown, and then strawberry blonde. It's not proportionate. I love it. نظر منم میخوای بدونی؟ شور. آیه ابسلوتلی به خدا قسم لابد. 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 لابد.